I'm Jason Roselle. You're watching Get Inspired with Jason. In today's dating episode, we're going to talk about what are the most important things that you seek in a partner. A lot of times, we're in a rush. We're single. We're excited. We're on dating apps. We're getting set up on dates, but we're forgetting. Wait, wait, wait. Don't just set me up. What are we really looking for? A lot of times, we go on the outside in. How good looking they are. What's their height? What's their body type? What, what Do they have big muscles, little muscles, skinny, fat? The list goes on but we're forgetting a lot of the values that we're seeking. A lot of times people are set up or say online dating and they're finding someone, hey, hey, you look pretty good. Yeah, I like that booty. Oh, I like that chest. That's great and dandy. But let's talk about what are the most important things to you? What's gonna withhold longevity? So you have to ask yourself first, what kind of a partner do I want? That is if you want a longevity partner, someone you could potentially marry, have kids with, etc. Or maybe you don't want kids, maybe you don't want marriage, but you want to find the ideal partner. Maybe someone that when you're actually really sick or in your deathbed is going to actually care for you. So these are important factors that I want you to remember when it comes to dating. Do yourself a favor and write a list of what are the most important things. The pros and the cons. Meaning, what are the most important things? What are the things that you know you cannot deal or live with? A lot of times we rush. Do not rush. Just do me a favor and breathe. Let it out. Inhale. Let it out, right? Then you just really patiently have to write things down as to what is important to you, right? Is it financial status? Is, is, are the looks that important, right? Whether they have a certain particular body type, career. Ask yourself these questions because at the end of the day, Whatever you are seeking and you want to manifest, you must write this down just like any desire that you have in your life, whether it's your body, whether it's your career. You think you're just going to get lucky or just, you know, like a lottery ticket? Oh, well, th this looks pretty good. She looks pretty good. He looks pretty good. No, you got to write things down. Make a plan of action in which you know what you're willing to accept what you're willing to not accept, but most importantly, what's gonna make you happy. Ask yourself, if the guy has a certain type of look or she has a certain type of look that you really desire, do the other things that you want, such as communication, such as do they have a huge heart? Are they affectionate? Are they loving? Are they sexual? Are they whatever things are important to you? A lot of times you get set up or you go on dates with people that physically are appealing but we fail to ask the most important questions. What is that person looking for? Are they seeking the same things? Do they have the same time that you have available? A lot of times we don't really have the time. So all these things matter. Make yourself a list of what is most important to you, what you can live with, what you can live without. Because at the end of the day, what's gonna make you happy is what is most important to you. What is gonna be more important? Is it gonna be looks? Is it gonna be how someone treats you? Are you willing to give or take? Example, are you willing to be involved with someone that is slightly overweight but treats you like gold? Are you willing to potentially say you're a taller female and date a shorter guy? Are you willing to be okay with that if they are treating you exceptionally well, they are immensely loving, successful? Ask yourself these questions. Write some comments below. I wanna help you and assist you and most importantly, help you thrive in your life, your career, and your relationships. Why? Because you deserve it. Make sure you subscribe below, hit me with some comments, and I'll see you on the next dating episode. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer, and don't forget to click on the bell so you can get notifications every time a new show releases. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, and feel free to leave your comments. I'm Jason Roselle, and you're watching Get Inspired with Jason.